Hello again, friends. Okay, so I was going to screen record a few days ago, and I wanted to talk about making a tech pack and just a real brief overview of that. If you guys like this video or you want more content similar to this, just comment below or like and thumbs it up, and you'll get more of this. So, the thing I'm doing is some super cool pants, and it's in custom pocket, a custom waistband with some gathering. Same thing with the cuff at the bottom, belt loops double needle stitching and I made it all in Illustrator. I also did the construction pullouts in Illustrator just to make this process a lot more easier to manage. Um, for the construction pullouts you basically just call out every single detail like the sizes of the zipper, the sizes of the stitches, the kind of stitches, the size of the buttonhole, the bar tack direction and size, the belt loop size, Pretty much everything they will need to instruct your garment precisely. Precisely how this the flat is drawn is what you call out. This is my tech pack, the picture that inspired me to make those pants. My construction details laid out in Excel. Basically, you separate the front, the back, and then any details like it all what I'm interfacing. So you write that down. I wrote that the cuff is made with elastic as well. Because we send it to a factory, we want them to know how to make it. I identified where I would want crash wraps and fabric. This is my bill of materials. Basically, you say every single item you need to physically construct the pants. What kind of thread, what size, what kind of button, what, what kind of size the button is, what color the button would be, what color your regular cell fabric would be, your lining fabric, your pocket lining every small detail so that they don't have anything to discover themselves even down to how you package it how you send it the size of your labels color of your labels how many you need to make one and then also you would add the send outs that's basically just everything that's on top of the garment like your belt loops your cuff like if you're doing some sort of finish with the fabric like a wash a print whatever that's what you put in the send out category and you would also include the packaging so in short, Bill of Materials is basically just the list of materials you need to actually construct the physical garment, every single detail of the materials as well. The spec sheet is just going to be all your measurements from like waistband to the pocket, the hem, the belt loop distance, the belt loop length, the pocket width, everything so they know how to sew it exactly what size when they cut the fabric. And you also have your tolerance, basically the tolerance is like how much they could be off and then if, if they're too much off, like if it's more than one eighth off or if it's more than three fourths off, whatever tolerance you set, then you can get your money back from your manufacturer if they mess it up too much. Because you, they have that tolerance just keeping the same size. You can measure every single thing on the garment, so I'm going to take a moment to do that since you see I have some blanks. Uh, I filled everything in after a long time, a very frustrating time with my tape measure. And then after you do the specs, you have to call out everything on the garment so they know exactly what measurement you're talking about and you label it so it's clear for them to see exactly from what to what because some countries do it a little bit different and they might not understand just from the measurement so you have to label it. Clearly, I just did it on the additional layer in Illustrator so I could still manage it very easily. It's all in one document. so. Can access it and it's quite easy. Um, it shouldn't look that busy. I could have separated it a little bit better, but I did it quite fast. So I have everything together, but you can still see very clearly all my layers are separate and everything seems pretty clear. So basically, I learned how to make tech packs with different items. I am learning how to be a product developer. I have a lot more sketches and illustrator things, so I think you're gonna see a lot more videos like this. I know how to stream record. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and comment. Bye! But want those really cool pants?